Gentlemen, welcome back to the channel, welcome and back. Activision has messed up royally as of- Yes! We like to hear it! Get your pitch and forks ready, guys! Let's go for three likes on the video! Yeah. Let's check right it out. Right now, we don't know the full extent of how badly they messed up, but we can see- And it. we will never know, because they mess up every single time! A whole lot of it, and we're gonna be covering all that here in this video. So, as you guys can see, my gun's not loading in, because, I don't know, my gun just isn't loading in. But I'm playing a match here as a fresh level one. Yep. This is happening to so many- I mean, Swag would look at it and be like, it's just a normal day, right? Like, it happens every single day. I love to- just think, 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 and you will be fine. People I mean, out there. Bruh. So in today's update, which was supposedly just going to give us early access to the Modern Warfare 3 campaign, a lot of people have been completely reset Damn. within Modern <laughs> Warfare 2. As you yeah, this is absolutely wild, right? Because they, these seconds said that, you know, if you buy Modern Warfare 3, your data will transfer from Modern Warfare 2 to Modern Warfare 3. And guess what, my brothers? You know, the data, instead of being transferred, it's getting reversed. It, it's getting completely removed. <laughs> it is getting transferred. You know what? It's getting transferred, but it's getting transferred to Call of Duty Hell. You know what I'm you guys saying? guys can see, here I am, man. I'm straight up level one. They gave me my, like, OG spawn operator, but wow. not, like, any of the battle pass ones that I've unlocked. <laughs> In fact, the battle pass itself is completely locked. I can't access that really whatsoever. It still does show the kill streaks I had equipped. It still does show my Lockman submachine gun class there, but it's not able to be accessed because you have to be level four yeah. to be able to access mm. your creative class. Ah! So all my souls are gone, all of my soul rewards are gone, all of my XP Dang. tokens that I'm saving up for Modern Warfare 3, all of those are gone as well. Multi-billion dollar company, everybody. Say it with me. Multi-billion dollar company. I, I just cannot compute it, bro. It was a three hours campaign. Three hours campaign, bro. I thought, okay, well, maybe it's just more of a visual bad. bug than anything. Maybe if I jump into a game of multiplayer, I'll be able to level up yeah. and then maybe... Bro, just restart the game, bro. It's that simple act of leveling up will reset everything and make things go back to the way <laughs> they were. No, that isn't happening either. I get into a normal Damn. 10v10 match right here, and skill-based matchmaking is definitely still working. Every single person on the other team is oh, pretty yeah. much using attack 50. Skill-based matchmaking, uh, friendly UAVs online, they will always work. And guys, I'm not talking about any friendly UAV online. I'm talking about friendly UAV online. You know, these skins, the, this will absolutely 110% would work every single hour in the day it will always work because if that does not work they're not gonna make money off of your dumb ass they're not gonna be able to make money off of anybody so that needs to work every every single day on every CDL hour skin, of the day. but regardless that can't stop old level one nero from getting a chopper gun around the hard point but yeah i go through this match right here get a bunch of kills get a bunch of score and whatnot i did join late so we did end up losing but regardless at the end of the game i didn't level up at all i didn't get yeah. any experience whatsoever oh, no, no, no. even i mean damn bro because they saw they saw you're a dumbass and you pre-ordered the game this is what you get bro this is a reward guys like, make no mistake, right? It's not a glitch. It's a reward for uh, pre-ordering the game, guys. That's what and it is. In fact, the source that I captured throughout the game also did not count. Again, I still have nothing when it comes to the haunting event right here. And when it comes to the Modern Warfare 3 campaign itself, I'm also not able to play it because according to the Call of Duty HQ, which is like this system that they say is going to make everything seamless and work really well, <laughs> it's the exact opposite. According to COD HQ, I never even pre-purchased Modern Warfare there we go boys and Sega's that are saying like uh well it's a, it's not a dlc it is not a dlc guys check this out you're not gonna believe it okay modern warfare 3 is appearing under modern warfare 2. you feel what i'm saying oh my god it is appearing underneath because it's a dlc there's no trophy no platinum trophy Legend says the modern warfare 3 campaign is showing an error to some playstation 5 players that bizarrely asked for the playstation 4 disc of last year's modern warfare 2 and that is if you want to play the game if you do not have the, the Modern Warfare 2, then Bumble Bumble Club. God. They took away my Zombie Ghost skin, which was a pre-order bonus. They straight up took that away from me. I no Damn. longer have access to that. It straight up says <laughs> I did not pre-order the game. And according oh to Modern God. Warfare 2, I've never even played Modern Warfare 2 before either. It just, what is happening? Yeah, <laughs> 
पता नहीं ये पेंच हो यार सो डॉलर की चीज खरीदो तो ये कह देते कुछ भी नहीं लेता एंज कर एंज काम कर दें ये पेंच हो साले यार बिनिंग राइट हियर सो आई डिसाइड टू गो अहेड एंड गो अ लिटिल बिट फर्दर विद दिस आई ओपन अप स्टीम एंड आई चेकड इट आउट आई वेंट टू द मॉडर्न वर्ल्ड पेयर 3 स्टीम पेज एंड या इट सेज दैट मॉडर्न वर्ल्ड पेयर 3 इज इन माय स्टीम लाइब्रेरी एंड ही Hang on. And further, I go into my Call of Duty HQ and I check out the DLC and whatnot. And according to this, the Modern Warfare Three campaign is in fact installed. But again, when I try to access the campaign, it straight up just does not let me. And when yeah. I try to play the Modern Warfare Two multiplayer, they reset me back to level <laughs> one, and I can't level up, and I can't gain souls, and I can't do anything. Like I'm just completely at a standstill. It Guys, emergency meeting immediately. Okay. <coughs> <coughs> Okay, emergency meeting immediately. I did cover this in another video as well. I'm not sure which one. If this video will go up early or that video would go up early, but you know what I mean, right? Guys, okay, emergency meeting. Crack your knuckle, knuckles. Get your pitch and forks ready. Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3 hangs up to 213 store gigs of storage space. 213 gigs, guys. 213 gigs for three hours campaign and maps that we had all the way back in 2009 and zombies ain't even getting a map let's guys it's it's on the wars one right 230 gigs these seconds don't want you to play any other game bro I I, 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 I wouldn't be shocked if the 200 gigs is just for the bundles just for the you know the the friendly I would not be shocked if 200 gigs is just for the UABs uh, and, and the, the texture packs of the bundles. You think that's justified? Do you think the game should be Call of Duty with 3 hours of campaign? Do you really think it should be 213 gigs? Because if the campaign was like 14 hours long or something like that, then okay, yeah, you know, 200 gigs makes sense. Understandable, right? But for 3 hours campaign and just a bunch of, a couple of remaster maps, and it's 213 gigs so how much how much in my honest opinion it should not be more than 80 gigabytes not three hours camping guess come on man like three hours camping if i had to guess what this is it's definitely a massive bug a massive glitch involving modern warfare 3 and the implementation of the early access campaign yeah. it's oh, definitely wow. that because everything was working just fine yesterday in fact i was streaming and playing as zombie ghost and running through and getting kills and doing things like that like i was playing the game just fine yesterday everything was there my rank was there my classes everything but today, when they added the ability for us to play the yeah. campaign early, if we digitally <laughs> pre-ordered, that seems to have broken everything. In fact, just going back to the scoreboard of the one match I played, look at the other team and look at my team. We see some level threes, some level twos, some level ones. Yeah. I'm interested to find out how they even got to level two, because again, I dropped like 20 kills. I was playing the objective, you know, pulling out a chop. Maybe, maybe they bought Modern Warfare 2 because, you know, they bought Modern Warfare 3 first, and then the game was telling them, bruh, you cannot play the game. You need Modern Warfare 2. So these suckers were like, okay, I need, I need to buy Modern Warfare 2 because I'm a sheep. I'm a sheep. I'm a sheep. I just bought Modern Warfare 3. It's a new game, right? But no, 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 no. I need to buy Modern Warfare 2 as well because I cannot play Modern Warfare 3. I'm a sheep. I'm a sheep. I'm a sheep. Because Activision is telling me I'm a sheep. That's probably why they bought it, maybe. Topper Gunner and stuff like that, you think that would be enough to go from level 1 to level 2? Maybe not, I'm not sure, but, you know, it's happening to a bunch of people in my lobby, and according to Twitter, as I'm just, like, browsing social media, it's happening to a bunch of other people as well. Yeah. Some dudes are lucky, and I'm happy for you guys. Hopefully you're enjoying the Modern Warfare 3 campaign, because a lot of people are just playing with no issues really whatsoever, and in fact, going back to the scoreboard, there's plenty of people in my lobby where their ranks are... I, I gotta be real, Dad. I personally had no issue watching the game on YouTube though and saving my money and guys this is one of those videos man Activision they will not like it if you watch this video check this video out guys it's a banger y'all I just cannot believe it so many youtubers came out they gave their testimony on Modern Warfare 3 guys check it out and I'll see you right there